Hi guys. So we got a, asked a question the other day. Are there any disadvantages of using the LED strip connectors? So that's a really good question. So if you were to use the LED strip connectors rather than having these strips custom made to lamps for you. So what we can do at Install LED is we can, if you send over the lamps that you're looking for with the, the corner links, and the starter lead cables and we can make them all completely customized, customizable for you and ship them for next day delivery. Um, in some cases people do not know the sizes of the LED strips that they are looking for until they are on site. So in that case they could either solder the strips themselves or you can use these LED strip connectors. So we have three types. This is a starter lead connector so this can be clipped over an LED strip piece and that will allow you the cable that needs to be wired back to the power supply. We have a tape to tape connector. So if you have two LED strips, you can clip them together to make one piece of strip. So for example, you may have a one meter piece and a half a meter piece. You can clip them together to make them into a 1.5 meter piece. Then we have the flexible corner connector. So if you need to bend around a corner, you can clip this side onto one strip, this side onto the other strip, and you can bend around a corner. So these are good if you are on site and it's the only option of adding the start lead or the tape to tape connectors, then you would use these, no problem. The disadvantages are, I would say, that when you use the start lead collector strip, so you clip this onto your strip, then the cables are very short. So they're probably only 150 millimeters. So then what you would need to do is either your power supply would have to be extremely close to the strip so you could wire this into the power supply, or you're going to need to extend this cable. So you're going to have a connect connector on the strip and then only 150 mil later, if you need to extend it, you're gonna have another connector here extending the cable. So sometimes it could be quite hard to hide that, or it might look a bit messy, or it might have to be on show. You've got two connectors very close, rather than if you had the cable soldered directly to the strip, then you just have the cable very neatly onto the strip with the longer cable. So that's with that one. With the tape to tape connectors, the issue is that not all of these fit within aluminium profiles. So if you're not using an aluminium profile, you can clip the connectors on and that would be fine. But with quite a lot of the profiles, the connectors do not actually fit in them. It depends what strip you've got. So with the eight millimeter strips, which are these connectors, most likely these will fit in most profiles. But with the 10 mil connectors or the 12 mil connectors for RGB or RGBW, then they will not fit in the aluminum profiles. And with the corner link connector, if we were to make the corner link for you, then you may have the corner link at any length that you wish. So if you're trying to make a very tight bend, you may only want a 30 mil cable to make a very neat bend and you haven't got much cable to hide. Whereas with these connectors, they are one size. So if you're trying to bend around a very small tight curve and you just need a short cable, then you're going to have two bulky connectors and a piece of cable that you've got to hide. So if you've got a profile that won't fit in the profile, or if it's in a, a neat area, then you've got to try and hide the cable. Also, if the LED, the cable needs to be longer. So if you're going around an item, for example, you're going around the back of a dishwasher, for example, you may need this cable to be two meters long. In this case, they're always the same size, around 150 mil. So that's the disadvantages there. So they are good, they do have their purpose, um, but if you can have them bespoke, made to left before, then it is definitely the best way to go. So comment away, any questions, and check out instyleled.co.uk, and thank you very much for watching.